Hello YouTubers and YouTubettes, welcome to another Luck Nurse Skills Tutorials. Today we are learning how to make a recipe using MCP with Modeler for Minecraft version 1.8. Firstly, you must have already set up MCP, and if you haven't, go watch the tutorial here. And if you have, follow along. Now we need to open up a text editor of your choice. I'm using Edit Rocket. It's a free program, and it's pretty good. Once that loads, we're going to make a new file and save it as mod with a lowercase m underscore and our mod's name. You can customize this to your liking. Now you need to save it in your MCP folder and then inside there there will be a folder called SRC and inside there there will be something called Minecraft. And the inside of there will be net and then in there will be Minecraft and then SRC again. And save that. Now next in the description of this video there will be a link to a file called mod letter syntax. Uh, we're going to copy and paste the contents of this file into our mod underscore recipe file and if you notice these little stars we're going to replace them with what this file is called excluding the dot java. Okay next we go to line 8 and type mod loader dot add recipe opening bracket new item stack opening bracket now this is customizable this is what item you'll uh, it will result in now if you want to block you go to the block.java and scroll down to the near end until you get all these public static finals here and notice how it goes block and then its name like block glass block sponge block wood and etc. And same thing with the item. So we go item.java, scroll down, and there's all these items. It's like item axwood, item pick axwood, and etc. etc. So we'll close these down, and I'm going to use item diamond, item dot diamond. And if you were going to do a block, you type block dot, I don't know, dirt. That is the correct capitalization. So we go item dot diamond comma space and this is how many you're gonna get. So I'm gonna I want five. Closing bracket comma space new object opening and closing square bracket opening uh, brace and then it should make it it should automatically make one on line ten and put on line ten a closing bracket and a semicolon. Okay, now go back up to line nine. And put two apostrophes, uh, not two apostrophes. Ah, I keep messing up. Okay, you put two quotation marks there. And s I'm gonna have to explain how this works. Basically, this means the first row in your two by two or your three by three. And I'm just gonna demonstrate what that looks like. Ah, not that. What am I doing? Okay, so it looks like this. This is your crafting table, right? So you got your squares. You got your second row. Ah, space. You got your third row. Now, this equals to this row. If we put three spaces, it means there's going to be nothing in these. And if we put it in the middle of the screen, it means there's going to be something in the middle. And this corresponds to these two uh, rows. So let's put three dirt in the top row, meaning three of them have to be full. Comma, this indicates that it's going to be the, this is the next one. Let me do two more quotation marks. And then in here we're going to want know, nothing in the first one here, nothing in the first one here, so, and but something in the middle. So let's put dirt in the middle. And the same thing for the last row. Uh, space, dirt, space. Now once you're done with your recipe, you do a comma, space, character, ter, dot value, of with a capital O. 
and then two brackets opening and closing, and then two single quotation marks. And here we're going to put the symbol we've used. So we're going to use D, and then now we do comma space, and this is where we uh, clarify what D equals. D equals dirt for now. And if you had more than one symbol, you would go comma space and then repeat the um, repeat it for the second symbol. But when we're, we're not doing that. Wait, let me just end this here. Okay. Now, yeah, this is just something you don't want to know. So we are now done. So let's save that. Go into terminal. Which let's minimize this terminal. CD space drag in our MCP folder. Hit enter and type bash recompile.sh. Let that recompile. <sighs> okay, awesome. No errors. And then we type bash start client, which is how we test our mod. Dot sh. Hit enter. Okay, this loads up. Mm -hmm. Create new world. Okay, set up some video settings. Uh. Okay, awesome. Now, whoa. Okay, random. Okay, we'll get our wood. We'll make a crafting table. Hmm. And uh, we'll get our dirt, and I believe we have to have five, because there's three in the top row and two in the middle and last row. Oh, that's already six. So if you recall our, our um, recipe, it's three in the top row, one in the middle row, and one lastly in the last one. And there we go. Diamond. So if you like this tutorial, please rate, comment, and subscribe. If you didn't, dislike, I guess. And uh, if you have any errors, please send them to me. I'm more than happy to fix them or look at them for you. And uh, happy modding!